Welcome, this is the energy vibration reading for all sun, moon, and rising scorpions. I want to say thank you for being here, thank you for being back, and thank you for coming by and stopping by to get the energy vibration reading for the month of May. May is the fifth month of the year 2017, and I want to say to each and every scorpion here, it's going to be a really change in this month. It's going to be a wonderful time for you. Um, the zodiac energy, you have the energy of the devil. This month is the general energy of the devil. So in this month, it's um, a lot of trickery, a lot of stuff going on, and this is the general energy of the month. So what happened is that um, the fire energy this month is the general energy of fire. There's fire in this month fire fire a lot of fire in this month but you know you need to be aware you need to associate yourself with certain aspect in this month and certain things that will be going on but it is it is okay we need to understand that these things are going to be okay and we need to understand that we're all here on a journey okay so in this week what is going to happen is this month <laughs> what is going to happen is that the devil energy is going to um, move you to a different place a different situation and what is going to happen is that you are going to be victorious over certain situation and certain aspect in your life which is just going to be certain um, absolutely wonderful so be aware of this situation and be aware of what is going on around you realize that a lot of situations are happening because um, you need to move away from certain things and you need to break off certain things and you need to move away from certain aspect in your life and you need to understand where you are and how far you are and where and what things can happen for you so this is going to be a wonderful exciting time in the month of May because a lot of changes will be happening and you're going to see these changes coming in and with these changes coming in you're going to understand where you are in your life victory and success victory and success are here for you scorpion so this is going to be extremely wonderful remember to listen to the general leading readings and also listen to your Sun moon and rising signs please remember to um, um, thumbs up and uh, uh, share these videos as we look at the month the month is a month of uh, um, the situation happening if you have a mother that is uh, um, a, uh, a Capricorn a steer uh, a Capricorn a Taurus or a Virgo you have to be aware of the aspect of this person and you have to be aware of what is going on around you okay because certain things are going to be eels and expansion of love um, a, a, a change is going to happen for you and this person okay in the first week we have the energy of the four of Pentacles in the first week and in the, fir in the first week you're trying to balance out your financial stability and your financial situation so this is extremely good because um, whatever is happening between you and the lovers because the energy vibration of uh, the week is going to be the energy of the lovers and your focus is going to be the energy of the four of Pentacles so you are going to work in you know, out um, balancing balancing certain aspect and certain financial situation in your life so it's going to be okay and it's going to be wonderful what you need to know um, the chakras is that you're get you're getting the information from the universe from your crown chakra to release yourself of a partnership that you're in release yourself of a partnership that you're in because the spirit guides are coming up and they're trying to get your attention that the relationship um, whether business or um, personal is not good for you so you need to release yourself from out of this situation this relationship um, that you're having because it's not um, it's not the right relationship for you it's not healthy for you and this the other person in this relationship or the other partner in this relationship or the other situation in this relationship is not good for you so you need to release yourself from this romantic it is a romantic relationship for some people it's going to be a romantic relationship for some people it's going to be a business relationship for some people it's going to be a friendship but it's not very healthy release yourself from it and your universal angels via your crown chakra is awakening you to this situation so do it 
as we move forward we have the energy of the three of sword in reverse and this is good apparently you decided okay well fine this is not really the relationship for me so I am happy I am moving forward I am feeling better moving forward in this sort of an energy and it is better for me and it's going to be much healthier for me so this is a good sign this is extremely this is extremely a good sign for a lot of people who needs to break away from this relationship and who needs to understand that this relationship is not healthy for you and what is happening is that the universal angels came in and were showing you that you need to release it so it says your spirit guides are saying to you this is something that you are not supposed to be in it's as if they're coming in and they're showing you and they're saying release yourself from this relationship and in the second week you're going to accept that and you're going to release yourself from the situation whatever situation it is it's going to affect a lot of people in a lot of different ways and it can be friendship it can be you know an organization association that you have been with and you like the situation but you need to release yourself from it because it's not a healthy one okay there are certain things and certain aspect that is um, in the situation that is not healthy and the second week is the week of strength which I didn't say and the week of strength is week of fire and the the inner strength is helping you to release um, whatever um, negative situation that you are in with the energy of the lover so that's why I'm always giving you this is the energy this is the energy this is the energy of the week and this is your focus of the three of swords in reverse to release so you have no broken heart you have place an end to the situation and you're moving on and I'm smiling because something similarly is happening at this moment um, in my life and I'm smiling because it's as if the angels are giving me a, a thing to say yeah um, remove yourself from the situation impatient it's going to you're going to have the feelings of impatient that you need to just get over it and just let it go you need it like to happen like yesterday but it's going to happen so you have no do not worry about how long it's going to take and uh, when it's going to happen but it's going to happen so do not push yourself or um, you know expect that it must happen now because it's going to happen in whatever way it's going to do it's going to happen so be aware of the situation and understand where you are on your journeys as we move forward we have the second week the second week is the is the week of an earth element and it is the week of the Empress and the Empress is a wonderful energy is a nurturing energy if your mother is a, a hurt sign person you need to connect with her because this is going to bring in the ten of cups so wonderful wonderful situation and energy is going to come in so um, connect with your mother in this week in this month of May because you're going to realize how beautiful this relationship is as if for some people um, you have been away from your mother or your mother has been away from you and this relationship that is coming up and blooming and the connection between you and, you and your mother is going to be one of wonderful um, positive energy so this is extremely good so you know be aware of this sort of a thing and understand where you are on your journey because your journey is going to bring you a really uh, contentment feeling as you have an earth sign mother for the rest of the people the ten of cups is a wonderful feeling is a connection with a family connection that is going to help you to vibrate at a high energy vibration and you will feel so much at home and so happier within yourself what we have for this we have expansion and this is a wonderful message your throat chakra because through your show code chakra because the throat chakra is the blue energy and this is the blue energy from uh, the throat chakra and it's going to learn teach you to expand yourself so you're going to be more open up to the relationship that your mother and you're having and um, you're going to connect on a higher energy vibration level so you're going to expand in mentally spiritually and in a positive way so this is going to be extremely extremely good okay this is going to be a positive and extremely weak in the third week of May 
as we move forward we have the energy vibration of um, the emperor so a lot of people are going to have achievement and it's the people between the ages of 21 and say say you know 18 18 to 35 these are the people who are going to have a lot of success so if you are between the ages of 18 and 35 you're going to have a lot of success in the last week in the last week of um, May a lot of extreme success is going to come in for you guys okay for the older people uh, I will say for the people agents between um, 36 onwards up it's going to be a wonderful time because a lot of stuff Ability and balance is going to come in your life when you look at this sort of a situation you're going to realize how wonderful this universe is aligning certain things in your life and how wonderful beautiful things are going to come in your life in unexpected ways if you are um, if you have a father that is of a fire energy vibration and a fire energy is the fire energy of um, um, this is the Aries the Leon the Sagittarius connect with this person it's kind of an healing that is going on between the earth people and the fire people and you water people so there's a lot of healing going on and uh, for the people who whose father is of a fire sign which is the Leo uh, the Sagittarius and the Aries uh, connect with these people because you need to align a certain aspect and you need to have healing in a situation that has been going on and your um, your chakra is insecure it's insecure and whenever our base chakra is not ill so we're working in the fourth week with a, a red color and whenever our base chakra isn't ill this is what comes out that we feel unbalanced and insecure we need not to feel insecure we need to understand who we are and the part that we are on and we need to take up in harm and not being insecure of all the things that are happening okay so you need to be aware and you need to have positivity in your life and be positive and heal your base chakra so call upon Archangel Gabriel supervisor of Thor and the element master of fire and the fire salamander and the fire dragons to touch open and activate all your 12 chakras your base chakra your sacred chakra okay and ask them for a divine healing and as they heal you will release yourself of insecurity because there's a lot of insecurity that's going on and you don't need to have insecurity because your parents love you no matter who you are and where you are in your life okay I am using another energy uh, card I, I love using these and I'm asking my angels and guide to show me what to expect um, okay there's a little deceiving with your relationship in the first week. Um, the 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 heartbreak in the, the the third in the second week is going to be good. It's going to be healed. It's going to be cleansed. But um, there is um, some deceiving in a relationship. In the third week, you're going to um, be invited out to something. And, um, and 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 this invitation is the universe opening up a door so that you can connect with your mother if you have an earth sign mother which is a um, a Taurus a Virgo or a Capricorn the universe is opening up a door in the third week and going to connect help you to connect with your mother at a higher energy vibration and this is just going to be extremely extremely wonderful in the fourth week yeah in the fourth week we have the energy of a mother figure but yet still we have wonderful energies coming through because we have the energy of the bear which is going to be um, you overcoming a lot of situation in your life and this is going to be extremely positive in ways that you have not really had looked up on um, and, and, and see how positive certain aspect is going to be taking place in your life and um, um, you know the, the breakup is going to bring a depression um, it's as if uh, this this the stress is eating you up and but you're going to be okay 
you're going to be okay all right because sometimes it's it's all in the mind okay we need to ask the the angels for help and then you're going to be the stress illness is going to move it to a place but it's going to be okay and whatever way you look at it uh, um, the universe never give you more than you can bear and um, this sort of a situation is going to help you to move you and elevate you to someplace better in your life uh, um, so uh, you know uh, an and opening is going to come and it's going to bring a, you a good um, um, lottery. It's going to bring you good, um, wonderful blessings coming in your life in the month of May. And remember, your focus is the chariot, and the chariot is a, a situation of moving. And I can see why you're moving because whatever situation you're in in the first week with a relationship or so, there's cheating going on for some people, and this is why you should release this relationship. Some people are having an affair. Um, you're you're not the one who, who are having the affair. Um, someone else is having an affair, and you need to remove yourself from this situation. In the second week, you're getting over it, and in the third week, uh, you know you're you're having an healing with your mother. And in the fourth week, uh, uh, some form of financial help or situation or um, unexpected money will be coming in your life and this is going to be extremely good and extremely brilliant this is going to be a wonderful wonderful um, thing for you and an exciting exciting thing that is happening so I want to say to each and every person out there please connect with me by um, at the link down there you see katikon.com connect with me at katikon.com you can connect to with me also via clarity which is wonderful then we have you know um, uh, we can have a good conversation together on the telephone just let me know what time you can and I'm completely um, devoted myself to do this and uh, to connect with other people so that you can get to connect with other people in your life and please support my channel by thumbs up and likes and shares and some people are asking about donation you can always donate um, via PayPal because I use it to help to give other people free readings and help other groups and society and I want to say namaste until next month